Aloha everyone. I wanted to hop on here and give you a quick overview of what to expect when you start your Plexus products. I'm going to primarily focus on our best-selling combination, the Triplex, but I'm also going to do a brief overview of the other products in case you are starting on additional supplements. Just by way of background, I'm a Diamond Ambassador with Plexus Worldwide. I worked for 10 years as an ICU nurse, and I also have my degree in kinesiology, which is exercise science, and I have worked for 19 years in the health and fitness field as a fitness instructor, as well as as a as a personal trainer. I love health and wellness. I love to see people feel better and that is why I do this. First of all, I want you to know that these are my own personal recommendations. Um, Plexus does not claim to treat, diagnose, prevent, or cure any disease. This is strictly to help you get started on your products and also to understand what to expect and to have realistic expectations on your health journey. You know, I am all about health and wellness and helping people to get healthy in the right way. But the first and foremost thing that I want you to understand is that good health cannot and does not happen overnight. So before you even start your products, I want you to sit down. I want you to have a little journal or a notebook or some place where you can track your progress and track those small changes that you notice. A lot of times over the years, I have noticed that people are so out of tune with their body. They don't notice when they're sleeping better. They don't notice when they didn't have that second helping of food. They don't notice that they're starting to shrink. We just don't tend to notice those things. So I want you to become aware of your body and the positive things that you're noticing changing because it happens day by day by day, one little step at a time. Also keep in mind that whatever you've been struggling with, whether it's energy, weight, mood, digestion, any kind of health issues, it did not take you one day or 30 days or 300 days to get that way. It's been your the culmination of things that have happened in your life that have led you to where you are today. So be patient on your health journey. Know that it takes time to reverse damage and know that it also takes consistency. I will tell you one thing for sure after seeing and helping thousands of people start these products is that if you cannot be consistent, you will not have the same kind of results that someone who commits to the health journey and is consistent on their products. I can tell you another thing. If you are not a water drinker, you will not feel as good as you could feel. You need to make sure that your body is hydrated. So that means drinking at least half of your weight in ounces of water every single day at a bare minimum. On top of that, if you're breastfeeding, if you're exercising, um, if you've got extra stress in your life, if you already struggle with things like constipation, you want to drink even more water so that your body is hydrated. Remember, some of the main ways that your body detoxifies naturally are poop, pee, and sweat. And so I want to encourage you as you start your journey on Plexus to drink enough water so that you're using the bathroom a lot, to make sure you're pooping one to three times a day, and to try to get physical activity in. This doesn't mean you have to start a crazy fitness program, but if you can do 30 minutes to 60 minutes of physical activity most days of the week, that is really gonna help your body to detoxify and heal. Did you know that there are even benefits to your gut bacteria? from exercise, it's true, there is. So when you combine all of these different things with the supplementation, you are gonna have amazing results. So the majority of people start on the, the uh, Plexus Triplex combination, and that includes uh, ProBio5, BioCleanse, and Slim. And when you start, you're gonna start with one packet of Slim. Most people will drink this about 30 to 60 minutes before breakfast, tear it open, pour it in 10 to 15 ounces of cold water, unless you'd like to drink it warm, shake it up, and just drink it within 30 minutes. That's the best way to do it. Now, you don't have to take this before breakfast. You can take it before lunch if you want. You can even take it before dinner because this is not a stimulant that's gonna keep you up all night, okay? So that's slim, very simple. You can take this once or twice a day. If you struggle a lot with cravings, if you really wanna get a hold of that weight, if you've got any blood sugar issues, then you might be someone that eventually takes two. But I always recommend at least that first week that you just take one per day, just so your body can adjust. Next, we have ProBio5 and BioCleanse. These are our gut health core products that help to weed out 
the bad organisms from your body. So most people will start with just one ProBio 5, and the best time of day to take this is at bedtime on an empty stomach. It's full of digestive enzymes, and those can really work best um, on an empty stomach when, when your gut is having some digestive rest. So my recommendation would be to start with one at night, and you will gradually increase it to at least two, but anywhere between two and four, depending on your symptoms and what you're working on, and you're gonna work with your sponsor on that. Okay, BioCleanse is your gentle daily cleanser that's gonna help to um, support your body in its detoxification pathway of getting rid of all of that waste inside of your body. Most people take between two and six per day, and you're gonna start off depending on what your bathroom habits are like already. If you're already using the bathroom one to three times a day, you're gonna be someone that's gonna start probably on two BioCleanse. If you tend to be more constipated and you don't go to the bathroom every day, or it takes you a few days, or maybe you go once a day, but maybe not, you're gonna start on the dose, as it says on the back of the bottle, for BioCleanse per day. Now some people will take up to six. Six would be a max dose. Those would be our people that definitely struggle with constipation. However, I don't recommend that right off the bat you start with six. Starting with four, see how you do, and then you can increase. So again, make sure to work with your sponsor on that. Elimination is so important. The main ways we detoxify, remember, poop, pee, and sweat. Okay, so that's how to take those products. Um, next, we have Vital Biome. Vital Biome, I feel, is so um, vital to your results and to getting your gut healthy. Vital Biome is recommended to be taken very first thing in the morning on an empty stomach so all these good um, microorganisms can lay down their seed in your gut. Now, if for some reason you absolutely cannot take it in the morning, maybe you're going to flip-flop and you're going to take this in the morning and you're gonna take this at night, okay? You don't wanna combine BioCleanse with Vital Biome. That's one thing to keep in mind. So a Vital Biome, one capsule, once a day, very first thing in the morning would be best. And then moving on to X Factor. We actually have two different types of X Factor. We have our regular X Factor, <clears throat> excuse me, and our X Factor Plus, and how they are taken is actually a little bit different, so I'm gonna go over both. X Factor um, can be taken without food. A lot of people will take it without food, and you would take two of these. I typically will take it with Slim or with breakfast, and that's how most people take it. However, you could take it with lunch, you could take it with dinner, you can split it up and take one at a time for a total of two per day. X Factor Plus is definitely recommended to be taken with food. It increases the bioavailability. And so you can take um, two of these at once with breakfast or lunch or dinner, or you could split it up and take one with breakfast, one with lunch, or something like that, okay? So those are our core products. Now, when you start any kind of gut health regime or any kind of natural supplementation, you need to understand that the results aren't gonna be overnight. It's not like a drug that you take and it, it changes things super rapidly. Now, some people do have results very early on, but other people are appropriately slow. Their body heals um, and, and takes a little bit more time and that's normal. But sometimes when we start these natural gut health products, we can have some detoxification or candida die off symptoms. And sometimes it'll scare us and we'll think, oh my gosh, this is making me sick or I don't feel good on these products, or I'm not really having good energy like they said I would have, and I don't understand that. What you have to understand is that when your body is getting rid of these bad organisms and you're feeding it, feeding it all these good organisms with the ProBio5 and the Vital Biome and the prebiotics and Slim, and, and you're helping to detoxify your body with BioCleanse and the alpha lipoic acid and Slim, you are doing a lot of reconstructing inside of your body. So think of it that way. You are reconstructing and healing your body from the inside out. Well, you've got years and years and years of buildup of things that are not so good inside of your body. And so as you start cleaning out that body, on the inside, um, all of these things can kind of come to the surface. And so some of the most common things that people will notice in my experience is 
you know, maybe they actually initially have an increase in sugar cravings. Maybe initially they feel more hungry. Maybe initially they have a throbbing head and it's just, it's pounding, you know? Um, initially, uh, sometimes they feel more tired or they, they feel achy. Their joints feel kind of achy and maybe they have like flu-like symptoms and they, they feel like they're coming down with a cold. Um, maybe they're more tired. Right, so these are some of the most common things. Um, also, some digestive upset or digestive unrest, because remember, we are going into your gut and we are remodeling. And when you remodel your digestive system, you might have some GI side effects. It might be um, temporary bloating, uh, constipation, diarrhea, gas, right? I have that really bad. I'll just be honest with you. Really stinky gas and some bloating when I started. Some people will notice a temporary increase in weight and it freaks them out. I want to tell you just calm down. Don't focus on the scale. This is something that I would always tell my clients as a personal trainer when they started working out as well because when you start working out, you actually start holding on to some of that water more, plus you're building muscle. So when you're detoxifying your body, you can temporarily be holding on to more fluids and those toxins. And until those eliminate and get out of your body, you might hang on to a few extra pounds. But I have so many examples of people that initially gained a little bit of weight, but have definitely lost all that weight and then some. So stick with it, stick through that process. Know that these are temporary things that um, will not be there forever. Also talk with your sponsor because there are several things you can do uh, in addition to this that are very inexpensive to help your body to manage that detoxification uh, process. And remember, water, 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 rest, exercise, and eating nutritious foods, trying to avoid those sugary foods, those added sugars, those carbs and starches, um, so that your body can be feeding the good organisms and not the bad organisms. So know that some of those things might happen. Know that it's temporary. Um, work with your sponsor closely to keep you on the right track. One of the most important things to remember when you start is that Plexus is not a do-it-yourself project. You need the help from your sponsor. And if your sponsor doesn't know the answer, go to someone else that can help you. But you want that help adjusting your supplements up and down so that you're feeling better faster. So I always tell people, don't go dark on me. Talk to me because I want to help you. And I know that that's how your friend or family member is with you. They want to help you. So I'm going to take a moment to just go over a couple other products and how I generally recommend people start the products. Again, this is my own personal opinion. And you might get different advice based on your condition because remember, every body is different and you might need to take things a little bit differently depending on if you're, you have certain conditions or you take certain substances on a daily basis. Um, you may need to adjust things so that is why it's so important to talk to your sponsor so I want to talk for a moment about boost and accelerator these are both thermogenics and these I believe should people should start out with just one capsule a day when they start these you would not take both you would choose one or the other so either one of these your first few days I would recommend you just take one capsule with breakfast see how you feel after a few days on it if you feel good then you can add in that second capsule, but I still would not recommend that you take two together. I would recommend that that second one you take with lunch. I don't typically recommend that people take this in the evening, past five or six. Some people, including myself, have used Boost as a pre-workout, and I will work out at night, and I'll take it at five o'clock, work out at six, totally fine, I can go to sleep. But um, if you're not gonna be an evening workout person, I wouldn't necessarily recommend this in the evening or this because they do stimulate the body and give you extra energy. So again, start with one uh, with breakfast. See how you do with that. If you do okay after a few days, add a second one in with lunch. After a while, if you feel great and you want to combine them and you feel a better effect and you, you want to take two capsules at once of this or two capsules at once of this, you can do that. And by combining, I don't mean combining both products. I mean combining both of your capsules and taking them together. So that's Boost and Accelerator. Block 
is a carb blocker, and it blocks up to 48% of the carbohydrates you eat in a meal. Not an excuse to overeat carbs or eat too much, but it's a great tool to use. You can take it before one or two of your largest meals of the day, and you'll just take it immediately before. You want to make sure that you drink a nice big glass of water with this because it will expand in your stomach, and if you're dehydrated, you might have some problems in the bathroom. So make sure that you're hydrated when you take block. It's an excellent product for blocking those extra carbohydrates which will then turn into fat inside of your body so that's block I recommend that the first few days uh, or week that you try this that you just take it before one of your meals and if you feel good doing that then after a few days or after the first week you can add it in before a second meal okay and it's two capsules at a time Edge is amazing for increasing mental clarity, focus, and um, just your, your general energy during the day. And Edge, you want to just take one capsule per day. I generally recommend uh, in the morning with food. Always better with food and typically with breakfast, but you could also take it um, with your lunch as well. I do have people that work night shift um, in the hospital or other night shift jobs that will take this. Uh, before their night shift with dinner, and it really helps them to get through their night shift. This is excellent for people that also have caffeine habits, energy drink habit, habits, Starbucks habits, those habits that they want to break because it's clean, it's three simple ingredients, so love this one. The final one um, is Mega X. Actually, I have two more. Um, Mega X is a plant-based omega, great for heart health, brain health, and nerve health, um, and relaxing the body as well and decreasing inflammation. So Mega X, typically people take at bedtime. Two at bedtime, um, maybe with your probiotic five, uh, if you're taking probiotic five at night. So that's how you would take Mega X. It can be taken with or without food as well. I typically don't recommend it first thing in the morning because it can make some people feel more relaxed and sleepy. So that's why at bedtime, plus it can help you to have better uh, sleep that way if it does make you feel relaxed. Um, last but not least, I'm gonna talk about Ease, which I love. Ease is um, a discomfort reliever. And Ease should, you know, ideally be taken on an empty stomach if possible because the digestive enzyme will work better on an empty stomach if you're dealing with discomfort issues. You can take anywhere um, between two and six or more per day depending on what's going on with you. But again, try to take it on an empty stomach and removed from food so it can really do its work if possible. So that's just a little bit of overview of our products. Again, I want to encourage you to stay consistent with your products, to drink your water, to really dive into this health journey, to do the other things that you can do to improve your health and your life. I know that if you do these things and you're consistent, you have good communication with your sponsor, you add in the products that you need because, you know, Maybe you've started with just the triplex and honestly, you probably you know, need that X Factor Plus too. And maybe you really need Vital Biome as well. So be open to learning about other products because every body is different and every body requires different nutrients and different amounts. By and large, everyone can benefit from the triplex and X Factor, but think about adding in some of these other supplements to enhance your results and to work closely with the person that's helping you. So I hope this helps. Have a great night. Aloha.